today. Good morning, everyone. Hey, Shelly. Hi, Facebook. What's up, YouTube? How are we doing? Oh, so you all have seen me groom this fur baby, for real, a lot. And it's pretty cool to see every time she comes in, besides the initial meeting in the lobby, which I think that, that she will always meet people like that. It's like, rah, 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 like that. I think that that will never change, but once she's peeled away from the owner, it seems to be better. But this is Hennessy, and we've been grooming her since August 2021. It is March 2023. So you can see over time, you know, she's come in on an average, eight, nine, nine, 10, 11, on an average for the most part, every two months. Sometimes due to work, um, pet parent like this one is a little bit behind our two months, but not by much. I don't want to say they have to brush her very often because we do always do the 10 all over. Yeah, so there was like five, May 2022 to September 2022, then 11. And then my rescue cat's running around here. What you doing? Okay, 11, 29. Okay, let me see. So, I think I hear her. <laughs> okay, let's go get her. Let me get my gloves on. You know, once we get, get out there, you have, gotta have your gloves on. I've learned that the hard way. Coming in here and I've got an aggressive dog running around. And my gloves aren't on. Gloves because I don't want splinters. Mask so I don't breathe in all the hair dander and, and the hair that flies around when you're clipping hair. Okay. guys hear her? She, she would not, she's not happy with that. Stay there for just a second, okay? Let me go check to make sure the
helps us. Hi, Hennessy. Hi. Hi. I'm going to put all this on you as our backup plan. Yeah. Hi, girl. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hi, girl. Oh, oh you laying down. Do you want to rub your belly? I don't want to rub your belly. Oh, my gosh. What the heck? You've never done that before. Man, your paws are, look how hairy your paws are. Look how hairy your paws are. Are you laying? Uh, look, can I get you guys over here? Look at this. This is crazy. Come here. Try it again. Come over here. Try it again. Come over here. Come here, Hennessy. Lay down. Roll over. Roll over. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down all over. Let me rub your tummy. Let me rub your tummy. Good girl. Good girl. That's not how you were acting before. Oh, no. No. I. Yeah, can I? Okay, can I give you the go give a wool? Who do you do a drop ball ball? Yes, good girl. Good girl, look at how cute you are. Look how cute you are. You're so cute. Okay, can you get up? Okay, I still have to put this on because you, you might still bite me. Come here. Let me take off. Can I take this off? Can I put this on now? Come here. Let me put this on. Good girl. Sit up for me. Sit up for me. Okay. I'm going to pick you up. Come on. Up, 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 up. Okay. Okay. Can you wait a second? Let me get everything on the floor. Hold on. Hold on. Come here. <laughs> Come here, girl. Oh. Oh. Yes. You're such a good girl. You're such a good girl. Very good. That's all loose. Just work with me. That's all loose right there. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. really? We've come a long way then, huh? We've come a long way. Coming a long way doesn't mean they'll never bite you. It could still mean they try to bite you every time. But we've come a long way. And you have to acknowledge that, you know? Such a big deal. You weren't rolling around doing that when I first met you. No, you weren't. Oh, no, you weren't. Come here. Oh. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. Oh. This makes me so happy. I'm so happy. Now, I'm still, don't think you can put your guard down. You can't. You can be happy, though. You can totally be happy. <laughs> Good girl. Good girl. Okay, let's take it all off. It's okay there. Do you think you, that's, that's okay? Sort of. Need like a sweet spot for the cameras. So this right here, this length of hair, the grow out, is really like just over two months of hair growth, I believe. I have to double check, but maybe through right at three months, I have to double check. So that's how much hair will grow back if you do the summer cut in about three months. Water, I need my water sprayer. Like that. I'm gonna spray a little bit like that because it's wet in here. I mean, it's dry in here. <laughs> your hair, your hair is dry, you know. How many of you guys out there also work really 
hard, and it's really hard to kind of get things going, make appointments happen. How many of y'all also have that kind of crazy schedule? Can you relate? Or most of y'all out there watching right now are stay at home or retired? Who, who's out there watching? What, what is your status? I find it quite hard to watch videos. I work a lot. I, I also actually find it quite hard to watch videos. So those folks that are really, really working hard, they, unless they can play it while they work, which that's true, I play a lot of stuff while I'm working at home at night. You don't like that? You don't like that? I better pay attention. I think I feel like you're normal, but you're not. I, I forgot, okay? Almost forgot. You're awful far from me. So usually you know how I use my 18 inch table. So see how far away the pet is from me on this, this very big table. This I'll need for an aggressive dog situation, but I don't recommend a table very wide when you're working with a small dog, which is why when you order a table from me, I usually call you. Unless you've told me on the notes, you know, what what uh, dog you're grooming because there's a lot of leaning forward there. Watch the pivot of my lower back. Thanks, Hannah, for letting me know you're taking the day off. Please take a day off. And what, unless you need to do what I do, which is work a lot. If you want to work a lot, go ahead and open up two or three businesses. That's what it entails. It's like it never stops. But if you're able to take two days off a week, please do. It doesn't have to be consecutively, but it's nice if it is. If you can't take a Saturday and Sunday, don't take a Monday, Tuesday, okay, or a Sunday, Monday. But definitely, if you're listening to me and you're out there and you work a lot, please try to give it back to yourself. I'm kind of dreading her feet. Her feet look a little like mud stuck in there. I hope it goes well. I'm going to save them for last. I'm moving pretty, I feel like I'm moving pretty fast. The Tim Blade is just a little tiny bit warm. It's a ceramic. So that's great. And then when I move off the body, turn the clipper off. I would love for you guys to shop with me at myfavoritegroomer.com. You can get your blades and clippers there. Some of you guys are emailing me about your clippers, wondering some questions, and let me see if I can capture some of those questions right now. I'm going to demo two cheap clippers. I really am. I'm going to demo them. I got them charging, so they'll be ready for tomorrow. But cheap clippers, under the, under, usually what I've seen, under $150, okay? Under $150, brand new clippers usually don't last more than a year, if not months. So if you're going to compare what I'm doing and try to get the same quality out of a $100, $60, $80, $35, $39, $99 dollar clipper, I don't care where you buy it. That's not a clipper in my opinion. And I can just tell you by the dollar, the price point, that's not a clipper. I mean, I told myself I'd save that for last. That cheap clipper is not one that's going to last. This has lasted over 15 years. So that's not going to be the same kind of quality you're going to get. So it just depends on what you're wanting to do. Are you wanting to replace your clipper in a year? If you are, buy a 
$34.99, What did I buy them for? I mean, under $50? But don't be mad when it's broken. And don't expect the guards to work like you want it to. They're not my guards. They're not the guards that I'm using, I mean. Completely different product. But some of you guys are, are okay doing that. Some of you guys are okay buying something new every time. I'm not. I don't want to do that. I feel like that's a waste of money. And for a small business like me, when it comes to buying products and trying to get you to buy them from me, I have to really know that they're going to be of quality, right? Don't you think? But I am going to demo a couple because some of y'all out there still want to do that. You guys want to buy your clippers on Amazon or low-cost places, and then you want, you guys own them. So I'm, I'm demoing them. I'm going to demo them for you. You guys own them. I see them. They come. I've seen them two or three times now, so I am... I know you don't like it. Come here. So I'm going to demo a couple for you, but don't think that you're going to get the same power, the same cut, or the length of the clipper time, the longevity of holding that clipper, the same as mine, if you don't spend the money. And I'm not just telling you that. I'm being real. I'm being real with you. Girl, you keep sitting down on me. I don't know what I'm doing here. I can put this under there. Dog, dog up plus. Here, I need you to stand, please. We'll put it down like, like sideways and put the elbow like that. Put the round part in the elbow, round part there. Perfect. Did you notice I kept putting up and up and up and up, right? Yeah. Just save me a minute here. And some of these clippers come with these plastic guards. The plastic guards on my Bruvera, I've never used them to show you, right? Maybe once to demo them. They just push the hair down. I told a client the other day that ordered the Arco. I talked to her a long, a long time about that because what she was going to use it for. I said, it's not designed to do full body haircuts for years and years and it's still in work. It's not designed for that. At least... I've been briefed on that too. That's why I was told by my sharpener. That's why those clippers come back to servicing a lot more than other clippers. Is because people use them where they're not supposed to use them. And they wear them out by doing that. So the type of clipper you get is designed for certain things. And it may or may not last. Like, I have the, the Bravura, but do you see me shaving dogs with it every day? No, the answer is no, I don't do that. This is going to be a tough one today, with me. See all that mud on there? It's been pretty rainy here. Uh, we've had all kinds of weather since I've seen her. Don't get mad. I'm so sorry. I'll have to be the one to take it off. I need to see your foot, please. Thank you. Okay, don't get too mad here. Don't get too mad, please.
Why is there static? Why? Why is it? You know why? Because we had, we had to turn our heaters on yesterday, and the day before that we had to turn our air conditioning on. And then today it was borderline like it wants us to turn our heater on, but it's it's almost like I need my air conditioning on, <laughs> right? The weather here, just in Texas, just is something else. It's a big mess down here. That's how dry the air is. Oh, I'm glad I put two on. That one came flying off. Okay. There's a bundle pack of the cone heads, so you can have two. One is, like I saw, float flies off. And the other one is on. It's on my website, myfavoritegroomer.com. I decided to put two in one so you can get both the plastic and the comfy cone together. Tell your mom you gotta come in earlier. You gotta tell her, not me, honey. I know it's painful. Once I get all the top stuff off, can you see? Then I can start taking the stuff on the bottom of your feet off. Which is, uh, it's not going to be your favorite, but just work with me on that. And once it's off, it'll stop pulling. Mud that's dried will pull, just like dingleberries, will, it's dry and dried onto the foot. It will pull and probably hurt while it pulls. Okay, so I get it. And then that will be the toughest stuff we have to go through, which is about right about now. And I'm kind of like, I'm liking your tail a little bit. I'm, I'm not that I want to not shave it, but because we always do shave it. So what I'll do is, let's do a four guard on it, which means it's pretty short, but not all the way shaved, okay? All right, this is going to be a tough one. I'm going to get my 440 blade, and we're going to do your feet, okay? Please, please don't get mad at me. This is going to hurt. I think this is going to hurt a little bit, so we're going to come really get close up here, okay?
do this one now. I'm taking my 40 blade and going in between all the toes, getting the mud out. Okay, all right, great. Good job. Good job. Good job, Hennessy. Good job. Turn these all in here. Good job. We're gonna come do this last one. Okay, there you go. Hang on, hang on. Don't get mad. This is the last one. This is the last one. Work with me here. Work with me, girl. Good girl. I'm so sorry. See you here growling. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Aggressive dogs, we don't want to get them upset. You need to come in just a little sooner next time. No, 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 no,
you were attacking and everything and freaking out. Remember that? Oh, yeah. And now I, without even giving any treats or anything, like, I got you, I got you. Give me a hug. Give me a hug. Don't breathe. Breathe. Good girl. Thanks for letting me get all that off. Now I know. I know. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. There's still a little bit more in there, huh? Look at me. Look. Look. Oh, she's all oh, that came right off. Okay, here. Let's turn it on. Put it on tighter. Come here. Don't get upset. Good job. Good job. Good girl. Okay, good, good girl. One more. One more. Okay, good girl. Come on, Dee Dee. Put those on. Good girl. Now look. Will you do me a favor? You're just going to have to just hang in there. Just, just hang in there. Just a tiny, tiny bit more, okay? And I'm so sorry. Or I'm so sorry. It's quite painful. Just, just hang in there for me, okay? Okay, one more time. Okay. One more time. Okay, just hang in there. Just one more paw to finish up. Don't get too mad. Don't get too mad. Don't get too mad. Hey, 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 Hennessy. Hennessy. Oh, gosh. Hennessy. We have to do this. And we have to. I have to do this. I have to get it out. You know? And I have to go tighter. I have to go tighter. Okay? Yeah, don't look at me like that. It's not, I didn't do it. Why do people always get mad at me? Why do people get mad at me when I'm just the person that has to show you how it has to be done? I don't understand that concept at all, ever. People always get mad at me for what? Makes no sense. Do you mind? Come here. Okay, let's let's go into something else. Like, please don't tell me that's a flea. Please tell me that's not a flea. Okay, change the subject. Come in this way. Go reverse. I got you. I got you. I got you here. I got you. Work all this out. her feet. Good enough. It's off, but it's not perfect. So I'm not trying here to piss you off. Okay, we don't want to piss you off. Key is when you're grooming an aggressive dog, they're already aggressive. You don't want to upset them. You don't want to touch any triggers. You just want to keep it peaceful. And if it's painful, you can't keep it peaceful. You're always welcome. I know you guys are far. You're always welcome to come in and do face feet sanitary when you can't do a full grooming, whether that's budget. Because nails should be done every six to eight weeks. Yeah, six to eight weeks. 
And some of my clients, I don't see them very often. So it's like, well, those nails, the vein is growing out with that nail. Six to eight weeks should be a toenail trim. But since some folks are pretty far, I don't, I don't I, you can't require that. I mean, I guess you could if the dog's pretty aggressive. It's like, look, I'm not going to mess with your dog unless you come in every six to eight weeks. I guess I could do that. Because I, I make it a requirement to walk the dog. If your dog's aggressive, you need to get here and walk your dog first. See all that mud on there? It's not like she can't get muddy, people. It's just that she is upset for grooming. So you don't want to lead her into what's going to be a hard groom again. If, you, if we've made so much great progress, you don't want to reverse the progress by not helping out on the home front with your dog in general. Any dog that has difficulty being groomed. So the day it got muddy, the day she's running around out there pooing while it's all wet, like my dogs, you've got to take them right to the shower and wash them off. The feet. So it doesn't dry like clay. And then hold on tight and then cause pain on the removal. Oh, my God. Uh -huh, this is not painful. This part's all done. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. You're good. You're good. Good girl. Good girl. That's good enough for me now. Cool. I'm cool with it. Can you stand a little bit? You're going to start coming to your face now. Hi, look at your face. Do we need to take it off? I mean, it's so long. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Those are the easy things. That's the easy thing right there. That's easy peasy. That's an easy peasy. Hi, everyone. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to hit that like button. Thank you so much for being here, Facebook and YouTube. Hi, MP. Thank you so much for your donation. And those of you guys who are members, thanks for being a member. I appreciate you. Woohoo! Thanks for supporting us on YouTube. Okay, let's take our board guard on top of my ceramic 10 and let's do a reverse. And let's also, since she's uh, difficult, hi, I'm going to put this here so I can control some of this. And I may or may not need my face fold here. Okay, hi. Don't, don't get mad at the clipper yet. No, no. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use it. If I have to use it, I'm gonna use it. Don't get mad at me. Don't get mad. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. So thick, right? Your hair is so thick on your face.
Good girl. Come on, Diva. Look over here. That's a good girl. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. That's a good girl. You don't like it. Okay, let's look up. Can you look up for me? Come back to this other stuff. Okay, let's come back over here. Where's Dee Dee going? Hmm, where's Dee Dee going? Where is she going? She's going this other side. The dog, the energy, the static. It's real. The static is real. It's a real thing. It's a real being. It's got a mind of its own. <sighs> Give me my eyes a break. Okay. Doesn't want to come off at all. Okay. my templates about that time and do you mind if I come over you smell that while I grab all this hair you want to smell
is a little tough, so we'll put this on. Change this out now. The cone heads are off. So we can do that with our 18 inch versus our 24 inch. Miss Mel? Okay, thank you. It's almost like a, like I need to see that before it goes somewhere. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Can you look up for me? Is it possible to look up? Good girl. Can you loosen this? Can you tighten this a little bit? You just look up for me. Good girl. You see? You see? You see? Good girl. Good girl. Cha 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 cha. Cha 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 cha. Cha cha cha. Cha cha cha. Cha 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 cha. Cha 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 cha. Cha 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 cha. your nose. Yes, I did. I got a lot of the nose off. Do you see them tricks? Rub the back of the body, switch it up. Trick, trick, trick. Now she knows what I'm doing, so I have to back off. Now let's come in. Let's see what we can do here. Is it better? Problem with scissors around the nose on Shih Tzu's is that sometimes they have these wrinkles that you want to not cut, and this is not a safe area for me on an aggressive dog with scissors. Dangerous. There's dangerous stuff here. Good girl. Good girl. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Who is that? You can hear something? I can hear something too. Hmm? No, please? No? Good job. Good job for letting me do all this in your face here. Okay, I can live with that. Can you live with that? I can. I can live with that. Yep. Are you going to let me do a little of your chin chin here? chin here. Like, no, I'm not going to let you do any of my chin. Nope, not today. Not today, huh? No chin chin work? Don't look at my hand like that, no. Mm -mm. Which one? 
We're gonna do about five more minutes of the face and then I'm done. I'm not gonna keep pushing her. I'm gonna take her to the back. Dear Fly Girl, thank you so much for your donation. I appreciate it. She has a Shih Tzu herself. And uh, are you use a groomer yourself? Mm -hmm. Do you use a groomer yourself? Or do you do some things yourself at home? supposed to make a clear round cut if the dog is doing this. How is that possible? You can't. You cannot make clear cut safely if a dog is doing all these things. Like that. You cannot. It's impossible. So you look the whole 360, the whole other way. You're going to do the whole other way for me. Hmm? Very good. Very good. Thank you for having some patience with me now. I appreciate you. I so appreciate you. Yes, I do. Yes. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I appreciate your patience. Thank you very much. And the muzzle doesn't normally fit a Shih Tzu, but it's working right now just fine. Mm. Okay, let me see. Don't get upset yet, please. Let me see this side first. 
Let me see over here. I'm not going to give up on you. Not just yet. At least get the bulk of everything I need to get. So if I don't see you for a while, then we at least set up decently. doing out there today thanks for watching and being here I appreciate it thank you for your YouTube support let me see let me see this let me see this here let me cut all this out now is it possible is it possible for you let me see that. Let me see. Let me see it. Let me see it. Let me see that. Let me see the piece that you're putting in your mouth. Let me trim it. Let me. Let me see. Let me see it. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Let me see. We're just, oh, I got these new tiny combs I'm demoing and I'm pretty sure I'm going to bring them in. Let me see this right here. Yes, I got it. Yes, I got that too. Yes, thank you. All the things going in your mouth. Yes, let me see. Let me see. Don't move. Don't move. Yes, don't move. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry I have to do these things to you. Let me see, please. Let me see. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. This other side and then we call it done. You're okay. You are. You're okay. You are okay. You're all fine. You're fine. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening just yet. Oh, you're licking it all back in. I see. I see. Let me see this other side. Yes. Let me see. Let me see. Hennessy, quit licking it in. Let me see here. Let me see. Okay. A little bit here. Yeah. Okay. One moment. Everybody breathe. Yes, we got that all out. Yes, we did. Let me see. Oh, wait, shoot. Oh, I, I don't know how you can lick so fast. Don't lick so fast, please. Don't lick so fast. <laughs> it's a wonder you're letting me get all this, but you won't let me without the muzzle or what? Huh? Okay, great, great. Wait, don't lick it. Don't lick it out. Okay, she's getting upset. Are you getting upset? Let's look over there. Look over there. Over here. Okay, change the subject. Change the subject. Okay. Don't look at me like that. I see the look. Yes, I do. I see the look. Okay, thank you for, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for letting me get that off of your face. Yes, good man. Yes, ma'am. Good man. Yes. Okay, great. Everyone great? <laughs> okay. Will you let me pull your ear hair out this time? Hmm? It's getting bushy in there. I'm not sure you're going to let me do this properly, but I'm going to try. Okay? We put some powder here. Let me try my fingertips first. Just a tiny bit at a time here. Don't get too upset. Don't get too upset. I'm sorry. Just let me get what's in here. You can get my ear plucking kit with the cleaner and the flushing agents all at myfavoritegroomer.com. The powders all in a kit if you like. Just go to myfavoritegroomer.com and type in flush or ear as your keyword. The hemostats here will help you get down the ear canal which your fingers cannot reach. Unless you have little tiny fingers, then maybe they will reach, but let me see. That's it, that's it. Good girl, good girl. Oh, look at that 
that chunky monkey piece. Oh. Just what's in the ear canal itself. A little at a time. And we don't do this every time. So when I do have to do it, I must do it. Change the subject. Change the subject. I'm so sorry. We're almost done. Hair sticks to hair, so that's why you'll see me wipe it on the hair, or you'll have it have me wiping it on her head, or it's just a dirty coat. It's a dirty coat. So that's how all of the hair out of one ear. This is a hemostat. There's all different sizes of hemostats in my hemostat listing on my website. My finger will not fit in there. You're going to have to use a tool to help you. You can use a cotton swab. They're dirty but not infected or looking like there's an infection anyway. Let me see. You don't have to do that just yet. Okay, just not yet. Do the flap as well. I can see it's dirty. So I'm going to do the flap as well. other side. This is the last part of it and then we're going to let you guys go. These bottles, if you have a squishy one, I love them. So I sell them single empty. So if you need one, let me know. Come to my, my favorite groomer, go for empty bottle. This is the kind you can squish really easy. It's just puff, the hair comes up. The air comes up and the, so does the powder. It doesn't, it's not hard. I don't like the hard bottles when you can't squeeze it, you know? For difference, yeah, for most things, that hard, hard bottle, why do we, what? We need a soft, squishy bottle so we can just squeeze it. Whatever we're trying to squeeze out, we'll squeeze out easy. Let me see, just a moment, just a moment. Don't get too upset with me. You're doing so good. We're almost done with all this ear hair. Yes, we are. Let me see, let me see, you're good, you're good. You're good, we're almost done. Okay, let me come here, let me see this one. Let me see it a little tiny bit there, a little tiny bit, there we go. Let me see, don't get upset, let me see. Let, oh, oh, okay, you don't like your face type, okay. Up, 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 no, no, don't do that yet, no, no. Just a moment, just a moment, here. Think about something else. Think about something else, okay? Don't get too upset. Just got a tiny bit here to go. Tiny bit, here we go, almost done. Don't get too upset. Don't get, don't look at my fingers like that. No, ma'am, don't look at my fingers. Okay, let me see. Let me see here. There we go, is that it? That's, that's good enough, that's good enough. We got 99.9% .9 of it. Put all that here in the ears. Now, we're almost done, honey. We're almost done. We're almost done, babe. Almost done. Hold on. We're, let me clean that ear while I have it out. Okay? Clean that ear there. You're looking at everything I'm doing? Okay. Hold on. Hold on. It's cool. We're done. We're done pulling right now. I just cannot. There you go. See? We're done pulling. Da, 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 da. Put your foot down, please. Put your foot down. Put your foot down. Let me just hustle, bustle. Okay. Oh, you got it off. Okay. All right. Great. Got that muzzle off. Here we go. Don't. Let me see. Let me see. No, no. No, no. No, no. No, no. Good girl. Good girl. One more time. Just a little bit more here. Okay. The flap and everything. Good girl. Thanks for letting me put that back on. Okay. Girl, look how clear it is now. Look how clean that is. That's how it needs to look. Nice and clean so they can breathe. 
Okay, great. See how just a little dirty? That's all. Not a big deal. All right. Watching me groom Miss Hennessy. We're going to go to the bathtub and then she's going to go home from there. When you're working with an aggressive dog, sometimes they make stride and sometimes they don't. And sometimes you go backwards when you should be going forward. So that's just all a little bit part of it. She looking at the groom loop like how she, can she get out of it? Are you looking at the groom loop to try to get out of it? Hmm? Hmm? So are you ready to go? You are? Okay. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. See how you do after the tug. Okay? Hennessy. Henny. Henny. Hi, Henny. Just for a few minutes, you have to stand up here, okay? Just a few minutes, you have to stand up. Every three to five months, you have to stand up for Didi, okay? This is a doo 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 doo. Doo doo doo. We got the groom with a little in the way, but work with me here. Work with me. Work with me, girl. Yes. Work with me there. Well, at least we'll work for now until we shower you and see what happens. Let me see. Look up for me. Let me see. Look up. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. Look over here. Here, smell the brush. Or do something here with the brush. Okay. Here we go. Okay, good. Hi. Hi there, cutie. Hi, cutie. Hi. Hi, cutie. Hi, cutie. Hi. You see what it's doing here. Cutie. Yeah, you are. You're a cutie. When I groom you, I do think of Shih Tzus a lot. My Shih Tzus that are gone already, you know? I miss them tremendously. They're so sweet and so soft and so kind. You know? Hmm. What's that scissor doing up there anyway? Hmm? Don't lick the scissor. No, don't do that. Uneven trimming, yeah. Can't move your head like that. It's really important, you know, that you don't do that. Okay. I mean, this is, we still have to go to the bath anyway, but still, excuse me, excuse me. Thank you. Thank you. Let me see here. Let me see this part. Okay. Hi. Hi. Let me do a little bit of that. Over here. Over here. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, you don't like it? Okay. You don't like it? Yeah, mommy talking. You can hear mommy talking. 
You want to look over there. There's nothing there but a door. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm going to hear mommy talking. You can hear her. What's she saying? What's she saying? Hmm? What's she saying over there? Oh, that was a door shutting. Was that a door shutting? Hmm. What do you think? Was that a door? Yeah, I think that was a door. Little bit more. Little bit more. Look forward, Hennessy. Very good, girl. Very. Don't lick my scissors. Don't lick my scissors. No, ma'am. Look over here, please. Thank you. Hmm? Hi. Let me see here. Let me see. Let me see this. No. Very well. Very well. Get off, she says. Get off. I'm done. I'm over it. Yes, I understand. I do understand your point of view. I do get it. Yes, I do. So why am I going? Oh, I just want to make sure I capture so I don't have to come back here at all, mamacita. Mm-hmm. 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 With your cuteness. We've come a long way, haven't we? Yes, we have. It just takes time, doesn't it? Time and consistency. Don't they say that with a lot of things? Time and consistency. So your mom, if she didn't bring you as often as she does, we wouldn't have made this stride anyway, right? Yeah, we would not have made this stride in just a couple years, right? So sweet. You're so sweet. I think that's good. Yes? Sometimes you jerked a lot and you did not let me do the face all the way right. Sometimes she had a jerk, jerky jerk face. <laughs> all right, since I'm going to let you guys go, I'm just going to scan real quick. Everybody out there, hey, what's up? Those of you guys getting snow, stay safe. My goodness, we have really been pounded this year with snow. The end of this winter, I should say. Angela says, if I was working still, there would be no way I could keep her in a show cut. Laugh out loud, right? Cosworth, greetings from the Netherlands. Hello, Cosworth. Awesome. I have my shih tzu cut like that because of matting from him running in the snow. I can imagine. It would be nice to see a good view of the tail while you're shaving it. Melanie, I will work on that for you next round. And um, there's quite a few. Just type in my favorite groomer shih tzu. Quite a few will come up. We're almost done. I'm just going to glance at these. Lady Ray, thanks for being a member. Woohoo! It's Carla. This is Shih Tzu. Looks like this beloved Twiggy that I lost this past December. So sorry to hear that. I'm right here, Mamacita. Hey, Didi, you're back at your awesomeness. I love it. Thanks for always helping with our fur babies. God bless you and your family. Thank you, Charlene. Woohoo. I've been back a long time, girl. You're missing about two years of videos, I think. Sorry for your loss. I know it's difficult. Senior Fly Girl also had a loss. I told Didi that watching her has helped me with my grief. Thank you, Lady Ray. And thanks for being a member. Woohoo. Thank you for chatting out there, everybody. 56 of you guys watching, be sure to hit that like button. And thanks a lot for chiming in on this aggressive Shih Tzu dog trim. Can you imagine what we started off with? Oh, Didi has some great materials that helped me tremendously through my grief. If you don't have them, ask her about them. They were really helpful to me. I believe they will help you too. Woohoo! Thanks, Senior Fly Girl. Love you all so much, and we will sign off from here. Facebook, uh, thanks for joining us and appreciate your stars and points. Thank you, MP, and the donations that came through. Senior Fly Girl and MP, I appreciate you donating to your favorite live streamer. And we will see you on the next video. Have a great day and talk.